Megara and all that kind of stuff. I love Megara. It's mm. real hardcore um, coastal. Greens are dry because of the salt in the air and yeah. all this kind of stuff. Up and run kind of course? Yeah. I just rolled over your piece of sand. Yeah, it went straight over it. <laughs> that is awesome. That actually went in a good bit of speed too, didn't yeah, it? Yeah, no, that was good, good pace. There we go, so we're back to four. Short putts don't go in. That's, yeah, that's right. It's, it's just tip, it's good maths, you yeah. know? If the ball does not get to the hole, it's not gonna go it in. will not go in the hole. I so, often feel like, you know, I'd rather be two feet past and feel short, you know? Yeah. Because unless you know... You gave it a chance. Them. Exactly right. So, you know, you, and it's, yeah. the whole, it's the whole pro side pro side of the whole thing. Yeah. If you can miss most of your putts a foot to a foot and a half past the hole and on the high side of the hole, you're giving it a chance. If you're under the hole, no ball's ever gonna roll uphill. Yeah, you right. know, it's not gonna break uphill. Yeah. So you just you just gotta give it that chance. That's all it is. This is one of your fade holes, you know? <laughs> I, I don't like this hole. <laughs> Why is it just... I really don't know. You're a natural drawer. Yeah, I'm a yeah. natural drawer. Like, that swing on video should look pretty average because I'm trying to cut the ball, but I've just ripped it with a perfect two meter draw. Yeah. Yeah, I'm trying to hit that fade, but it just comes out like that. Do you ever open up your left leg a bit or? Yeah, I'll try that. Yeah. It just... That was the only real tip that worked for me. Yeah. But I'm a natural fader, so it's almost overcompensating anyway, like. Yeah. Oh, that is the ball. That is the ball. That felt so good because I've gone. I literally stopped about here to make yeah. maintain control, and I felt like yeah, right yeah. in the middle. Yeah. Well, see, you know, the whole thing of getting the club parallel. Yeah. It's false. It, it, it's we're straight to the teeth, and there's a bit of wind up there too. So at least the club, club, club line. Oh, that felt good. And the thing is, that feeling, you, just, you bring it to these shots as well. Yeah. It's exactly the same. It almost is like, that swing is like 75% of my normal swing, but yet it felt like it went further. Yeah, but because you, you middled it, yeah. you, you probably hit that with a, a crush factor of like 1.45, like you're yeah. getting the most out of it. Yeah. Whereas you try and hit the ball harder, you get a crush factor of 1.32. Yeah. You're not getting... Smash factor, sorry. Good, not thank you, that kind of thing, yes. Yes. 
So, currently four under through 17. Yep. So, just the 18th to go now. See, so we're trying to live the dream here, but. Yeah, I think right. it just slipped through our fingers. It did, didn't it? Just like the putting and all that, like, oh, crazy. Oh, yeah. well. Let's see if we can finish five under through 18. Yep, let's do it. Exactly right. Oh, you weren't kidding too. Oh, short of bunker. Was that short? Alrighty guys, so that was winning. We've just had to go across from the 18th to find somewhere to get out of the way. Yeah, um, that's it. So four under through 18. Yeah, didn't quite hit the, the lows that we wanted, no. I guess. <laughs> I did piggyback, so my shoulders are very sore. So <laughs> it was uh, quite an enjoyable round for me personally. Playing off, what are you off? I'm off three myself. Off three, and, and Chris has aspirations to go through the traineeship. Yeah, maybe this year, maybe next. Yeah. Have a go so. at the, uh, the P PGA traineeship. There we go. Um, and I've actually learned more today, probably, than I have in the last few years of just being taught basic things. Yeah. Okay? It's amazing how you can bypass the basic things and move on to the intermediate stuff when you're not ready for the basic. Exactly. You know, so you got to, as they always say, you got to get those fundamentals right. Mm -hmm. You build a good fundamental base, no matter what those fundamentals are. Like, you look at the different swingers out there, you look yeah. at the, Mo the McElroys, the Furix, they yeah. all swing it differently, but that's they've right. got the fundamentals. Yeah, that's right. So, yeah, you build up, you build up from there. That's it. We'll be going well. Well, he's going to be on the channel more. I've got to get some more tips out of this. So, <laughs> we're kicking out. Who do we have to thank in the front in the clubhouse? Scott? Uh, we've got Scott in the clubhouse here. He yeah. um, he basically helped set the whole day up. Um, we went out after the Friday comp, and uh, yeah, the course was in great nick today. It's, I mean, it's so green. We're not playing up the filter, it is that green. Yeah, like it really is. It's, 
I mean, I played here when it was during the drought, probably like two years ago, and we had a lot of. This is unbelievable. Like this is like somebody got a felt pan and just yep. went over. But I can't, I can't fault it. I think memberships right now they're doing the nine hundred ninety nine dollars special for new months for fifteen months for new members. For new members, yeah. I don't think that's rejoining members who haven't joined up for a year or two. I think no. they don't get that. But um, honestly, if I lived out here, I would definitely pay that because. <laughs> You don't find many courses nowadays where they get the simple things like, like the bunkers, yeah. you know, how they manic them, they cut them, it's always just perfect. Like, it's, yeah. And it's a great, great social social course. Yeah. It's not too hard, um, kick the ball straight. Yeah. There's some challenging holes out there, um, but that's what makes golf great. That's right. You know? It's actually right, it's not a daunting course. Like you go to Hills and you yeah. 460 minute par 4 to play the tees and Jesus Christ. Like, exactly. exactly. I mean, you have some long holes here, but they're playable. They're playable, yeah. Yeah, it's in golf now. You, you take some easy holes, you know, have a chance at birdies and pars, and then sometimes you got to take a look at them every now and then. That's right. You, you make that bogey or double. Yeah. That's you know. right. So, um, yeah, beautiful course out here at the moment. Come on down and have a look. That's right. Nothing beats golf in the winter, so that's uh, especially in Brisbane.